Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls from all... Today, you will see the magic of the theater and relive the time when the world stage was made for the merry... See one of the oldest art forms, gather round, and experience the wonder and mystery of kings, keys, and the secrets of the royal bohemian crown jewels. Good day to all of you! I am King Maria Teresa. Yes, I'm a king. Have you seen my beautiful crown? Ahem, yes. It must be known that this royal is the only woman to hold the position in her own right. You see, even in the decree, it wasn't easy to be recognized and crowned a ruler as a woman. And yet, you were crowned and wore this special coronation crown thanks to His Highness, the Holy Roman Emperor, King of Bohemia, Charles IV. Stop! <laughs> that is my crown! <laughs> The king who led the building of the St. Vitus Cathedral? Yes. The king who built the Charles Bridge? The same. And I commissioned that crown. It has become the symbol of the people, and it has been decreed that only the true king could wear it and hold the crown jewels. Oh, you did so much. Well, you we could go on and on. I'm flattered. But yes, you see, that crown truly belongs to me. Not anymore. <laughs> now it belongs to... Me! <laughs> Hello! I, King Rudolph II, do in fact deserve the crown. You deserve the crown? Why? Well... I brought Proc into the Renaissance. We learned to read the stars, and I made Proc the center of discovery with alchemy labs throughout the castle and... Uh, excuse me, O oh King, but I do see here that you did spend a great deal of time and money on those mysterious mystical experiments. Yes, there is that. But I put Prague on the map. That's nice, but how did all that help the people? <laughs> help uh, the people? Ha! Does that sound like someone who deserves the crown? No! Wait, wait, no! My crown! The story goes that rulers and wars would come and go, and the crown jewels were scattered to many different places. Until the Czech estates demanded that the king bring the crown jewels back to Prague. Exactly right. They belong to the people. Who are you? I am your son. <laughs> king Leopold II. I brought the crown jewels home. Then I commissioned a case to keep them safe. My royal keymaker created seven very special keys. At your service, the seven keys to lock it up. And I gave those keys to seven specially appointed people who could only unlock the case together. You were right. The crown doesn't belong to anyone but the Czech people. Here, your grace, the keys. And the crown jewels have been safe in Prague ever since. Yay! 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 Thank you. Thank you for coming to our show. And thank you to my assistant, Nancy Drew. <laughs>